<laughs> Fishing freaks, welcome back to the channel, y'all. We're doing a little vlog action today here at the tree house. Crispy collector right here. Got to do some work on that today. The flow, the creek flow. I was like, what is that noise? They're working on water like way up in the in the altitudes up there. And um, anyway, we got a bunch of water right now, even though we haven't had rain. Over here at the crispy. Attempted to install some trailer lights, but they were the wrong kind, you see. These are square, and they're just not matching up. They're not fitting into this section. Uh, they'd be lopsided like this, angling downward. Just not going to work. So uh, I ordered some rectangular ones. I have to ground these. There's a ground wire that you have to, uh, if you want to have a good connection, you got to ground that. But also, we're going to go deliver something uh, extremely special to a young man today. One of our business associates that's got the big ranch, you guys have seen a bunch of videos from there lately, that's where I've hunted. Uh, he loves to help people, get people out in the outdoors. He found out about this young man that needed a, uh, a special chair, a track chair. If you're unfamiliar with what I'm talking about, a track chair is basically a wheelchair that has tank tracks on it, allows you to go anywhere in the outdoors, do whatever you want. So Guggen Squad found out about it through him. We decided to donate to help him get one of these track chairs. And this is the awesome part is we're gonna go up there today and present it to him. And he has no idea. That's gonna be an extra special moment. Plus we get to go up to an awesome ranch today, maybe see some cool stuff. So let's hop in the truck. Let's go change the young man's life. I feel bad right now. I am cheating on Chick-fil-A today. Correct? Thank you. Thank you so much for your good service. That smells amazing right now. I will tell you this, and this is gonna upset some Texas souls right now, but y'all, a, uh, a Whataburger? That ain't it. It just ain't it. Maybe the old Whataburger, but the Whataburger's of the new, and I believe me, I've been to a bunch of them. I've been to the originals down on the coast little flip-flop hang on one second well bam back down it really is no better than a Mickey D's the service isn't anywhere close to Chick-fil-a and what I just experienced here at In-N-Out pretty darn good I know this is hurting some of y'all's feelings but I've just decided to come out and say it it's just how I feel Guggen HQ that's what I like about Texas. Yeah. Oh, I'm in a particular good mood today. Uh, here we go now. Staring at Silver Bullet the Third. If you haven't seen Rob's video, he got he also got the same boat, just in uh, a delicious Guggen Green color. And I will also say my truck is looking pretty good right now because yesterday I replaced the tires on this puppy. Right now, I'm just waiting here on Backwater Bryant to come up to the HQ. I nicknamed him Backwater because he's always talking about, you know, he's a fly fisherman. He likes to get back in the, in the skinny waters and the, and the streams, and he's from the, the deep woods of Alabama. This is his boat right here where he, he gets up on the platform and he looks at the fish. He's one of the Guggen Squad's lead camera guys, and he does a great job. But he's also like a resident fly fisherman guide counsel him and him and wes our lead producer backwater coming on in hot with another truck that toyota should make a diesel because they do all over the world except the united states it's called the hilux that is tacoma oh backwater rolling in hot from the deep creeks of alabama Shoo! Tires feel healthy, beefy. A little midday deer just frolicking in the fields. Now here at Toby's Ranch, he's got a shuffleboard table. None of us had really played shuffleboard table. We got obsessed with it. We got into, you know, betting and doing all sorts of things like, like playing these games. And so we decided to do a game on camera and then we wanted to do a bet and then do a charity donation. Like whoever lost had to donate. And Toby, the owner of the ranch, he told us about this opportunity to to give to this young man named Riley who had a really bad car accident. He lost some family members. It was a really bad ordeal. He was paralyzed from the waist down, but he has a passion for the outdoors. Loves to hunt and fish just like all y'all. 
but he doesn't have the opportunity to go out and really experience it the way we do. Walking to your favorite pond, going to your favorite deer stand, uh, things like that. He's, he has a motorized chair, but it's not off-road capable. So we decided to help him get one of these chairs. They're really expensive. Uh, there's a news station from Oklahoma up here. They're doing, they found out about it. They're doing a story on it. The coolest thing is he has no idea. Riley has no idea. Um, this is partnered with the Dream Hunt Foundation. So when me and Matt, some of the other guys were here deer hunting, uh, I met Chandler from the Dream Hunt Foundation. It's kind of like Make-A-Wish, but it's really for hunting. It's really outdoor geared. Let's go take a gander at this track chair, y'all. I've already seen it. It's thebomb.com. This is the track chair, my boy Backwater. How, how easy is that thing to, uh, to Super maneuver? Easy. Super Very easy, right? Yeah. It comes equipped with a, uh, a gun rack right here. Uh, you could also put a rod rack on the back. Riley's a big hunter, so they got it set up for hunting camo style. They, they put like a copper, some sort of, you know, like neutral outdoor color on the chair itself. And then... Uh, this is the, the system right here. It's got like 10 speeds. Uh, you can turn your lights on. It's super simple. I've already driven it around. He's gonna freak out. So he's gonna he's gonna come through these doors right here. He's not gonna know that we're we're gonna be in here. And that awesome track chair is just gonna be sitting there waiting for him. Yeah. It's gonna be the best. Riley has got his chair. You want to say hi to uh, all the LFG fans out there right now? Hello. Hello. And he literally said the first thing he wants to do is fish, but we've got too many outdoor activities we have to do out here. You got to go hunt, you got to fish. What do you think about your new chair? Uh, pretty sick? Yeah. Yeah? It what? can pretty much go on anything. It can pretty much go anywhere. You, ha you haven't even scratched the surface. Look at all this land you can go through. And let's go. Riley's gonna go on the hunt of a lifetime this weekend. Hey, I also got some lures for you, just in case we don't get to fish. You've got like a storage pack. Okay, here, I'll put them in there for you. Running out of light, but we're gonna give it an evening dangle for Riley. And he, he said, he's like, I wanna go fish. Just sighted in his rifle for his hunt tomorrow. And uh, he said, I, I want to fish. So we're going to go down here on the bank and see if we can catch some fish on the old zingers. Hopefully we can get him a good sniff, like his first sniff. I'm pretty sure he hasn't ever sniffed one. I don't know. There's some whitetail right there. Look at those babies. Can't see him. <laughs> Can't see him. Never mind. Yeah. So, or, uh-oh, more deals. Let's go. I want to hear it. No, are uh -oh. you getting me up at four? Nope. That's awesome. And we are back from the Battle Springs Ranch, y'all. It's funny, we ended last night, there was an armadillo like walking around as uh, Riley was, was going up the trail with his brother in his brand new track chair. And then there was an armadillo this morning when I woke up. I don't know, some, something armadillo magic going on. And then I come back here, he leads me to a, a rub from a buck in my backyard. There has been a buck just rubbing his antlers right here. And more awesome news. I just got word this morning that Riley got his first white-tailed deer this morning. He got a doe 
and they're heading on to another place to try to get him a buck. So he literally got his first largemouth, he got his first white-tailed deer, he's got his awesome track chair now, and he's going after a buck. The kid's just having an awesome weekend and many more outdoor adventures to come thanks to his chair. And last night I kind of ran out of hands uh, to film everything. I had backwater with me, but he was documenting the whole experience um, for them and the Guggen Squad channel as well as a wrap up to another video that we were doing. So if you guys want to stay tuned for that, follow along. I'll link uh, Guggen Squad channel down below and subscribe right here. I got a lot of projects going on this week. We're doing fishing, we're building. So if you want to stay tuned, you know what to do. Subscribe right here to the Lake Fork Guy channel as well. And I'm going to sign it off for today, y'all. Go ahead and just smash that like button for outdoor greatness. Changing a young man's life. I am so excited for him, y'all. And God bless you. I will see you in the outdoors on the next one. Later.